Pellet machines are overly complicated with less control. <laughs> they work fine for large format where you're just moving a bunch of material. But the reason for that is because the pellets are small relative to the amount of material being deposited. And it's basically the pellets appear to be high resolution compared to how big the part is. The reason you don't want to use pellets on desktop machines is again, the extruder stupid complicated. If you want to feed in one pellet at a time and make sure that it liquefies and moves all the way out to the nozzle, and then you have to be able to retract somehow, which is kind of tough because you can't, if you, the pellets aren't all connected to each other, so you can't pull back and create not, not negative pressure, but the pull back on it or pull it out of the nozzle that you can with a typical retraction. Uh, you can stop the flow and move really fast, so pellets could work a little bit better. But again, the extruder is really complicated, so it makes the machine really expensive, so it doesn't work for consumer applications, even though the filament is less expensive. And let's face it, a bag of pellets for 3D printer filament would probably cost about 10 bucks, which is about 10x whatever the cost of raw pellets would be. That all being said, the, uh, the other issue with it is, is the complexity of the machine, but it's pointless and irrelevant. The cost to convert pellets into filament is very low. The reason filament is expensive generically is because it's really uh, uh, expensive to store and ship and move around. And pellets weigh just as much as filament. They can pack a little bit tighter and they're easier to process than with filament because filament you got to spool and then you got to pack and so on and so forth. But the, the additional steps in the process of converting pellets into filament, which is a higher precision raw material, is trivial. So pellets are a nifty idea to get cheaper, but they will ultimately never be the primary way because it's you just lose so much control. Also, by the way, in like a factory, uh, pellets are messy. You can't transfer them around. They're not very controllable. They're not very packageable. Like there's just logistical problems with pellets. 